Hey, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be making an emulsified rainbow sugar scrub. Here's the formula and recipe for a one kilogram batch. Um, this will give you about five scrubs in those usual little pet tubs. Um, what I'm doing here is I've measured out all my colours. You can use neon pigment if you're in the UK, um, otherwise elsewhere I'd stick with mica. Um, and then I'm just adding a little bit of the pre-weighed oils um, just to disperse the pigment. This just avoids it going clumpy when you finally add it to your scrub mixture. So here's my weighed out coconut oil. If you don't want to use totally coconut oil, you can add an ester in like C12 to 15 alkyl benzoate. Um, that will help it absorb and leave a non-greasy feel. Then I've added shea butter and emulsifying wax, and then some cetyl alcohol to improve the feel on the overall product at the end. We're pouring all of that into a bowl and then heating it in a bain-marie. A bain-marie is simply a pan full of a couple of inches of water and then you place your bowl inside to heat up. This controls the heating to avoid your ingredients burning. Then we're going to mix it with a hand mixer and then leave it to cool to 40 degrees C. Once it's cooled and firmed up a bit, you can add your fragrance vitamin E and preservative and then mix up again with your hand mixer and leave to firm up a bit further. Once you've got the texture of thin cream or, or thin icing, um, then you can separate it into different bowls so that you can add your colour to each one. And this is where you'll see the predispersed uh, colour in the oil really helps it to blend in well. While we're adding the colour, I'm going to chat a little bit about the ingredients that I used since I went quite fast earlier. Um, we use the shea butter because it's a lovely humectant and it gives the scrub a lovely texture. Coconut oil, uh, specifically fractionated because you want it in liquid form, uh, is very easily absorbed into the skin and it's extremely lightweight. If you want an even more lightweight scrub, then like I said earlier, add an ester to it. Um, C12 to 15 alkyl benzoate is really good for this. Um, then our emulsifying wax um, and our cetyl alcohol, like I said, to emulsify the scrub and to add a lovely texture. Now that your colour is mixed, you can add your sugar. I'm using granulated. Just add the same amount to every bowl and then also your poppy seeds, or if you don't use poppy seeds in your country, then any other sort of larger exfoliant is fine, or you can add more granulated sugar and just whisk that in with your hand mixer again. You'll see the texture is very, very thin at this point. Don't worry, it does firm up. Um, this is what it looks like after 24 hours. Um, and again, it will continue to firm up a little bit. So you can adjust the sugar or the oils depending on how you like your scrubs, but I quite like this kind of texture. So once all your scrubs have firmed up to the texture that you want then you can pour them into your containers. Uh, the reason I left this to firm up overnight was that I wanted to do layers and that's easier to do when it's firmed. We add emulsifying wax to make emulsified scrubs because they wash off better in the shower. When the shower water hits the skin and the oils in the scrub, it emulsifies to create a lovely lather, which both cleanses and conditions your skin as it rinses off. If you don't have emulsifying wax, although you can get it from us if you need it, um, then I do recommend Ecomulse, or as it's known in the US, Retamulse. Um, that gives a really lovely scrub consistency. Also, as I mentioned earlier, um, the neon pigments, uh, they are approved for use in the UK in uh, wash off products like this, but I don't think they are in the US. So if you're in the US, you may want to be using mica instead. 
don't forget to like and subscribe i've got loads of other videos on the channel i also have a patreon which has some exclusive content on it including more recipes and we do sell fragrance oils and a few other ingredients on our website all of that's linked below thanks for watching <laughs>